Good morning, everybody. We're standing here behind me. We have a swimming pool that they did a lot of uh, tree cutting, right? Standing right behind me right here. There used to be two huge palm trees right here. Right back there, two huge palm trees. Over there in the back over there, palm trees. And right back there, right behind the spa, two huge palm trees. So let me take a look at, uh, show you guys the swimming pool. And um, I mean, let me show it to you now. And then obviously what else has happened to, uh, to the actual equipment. All right, so obviously because of all the cutting, the dirt the removal and everything, uh, all the dirt and debris all fell inside of the spa, all inside of the pool. There's a sun shelf there. It's gonna be a massive cleanup on today. Let me let's go ahead and pan over to the actual equipment itself. I have a Pentair Whisper Flow Pump. Like the basket completely cracked. And there's loads of debris that's clogged inside of the impeller there. So I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna try to unclog the impeller with some needle pliers, get this uh, pool up and running, clean out the filter, start to clean up on the swimming pool, and uh, show you the progress of how we get it done. Here we go with the needle pliers. I can feel it with my fingers. Here. A big old cleanup. All right, so we went around and cleared up the whole top surface, deading it and skimming the whole top surface. And then what we also did was, you're always gonna want to check the bottom of the floor because there's always gonna be things that get thrown in the swimming pool, especially when the stump grinder is chipping away all the stuff. And I have to let you know about my thoughts regarding this uh this job that was done by the landscape company but nevertheless you know, scan the whole entire floor for big product uh big items and debris such as uh, sticks and uh, any type of uh, boulders and chip boulders plastic pieces anything that may have been chipped out of the ground and thrown into the swimming pool uh, prior to us using our hammerhead vacuum cleaner to start cleaning up all the debris out of the pool so uh, we went ahead and did that now we're going to start with uh, the spa, clean up the spa there. Start with 
steps. had to stop just within the spawn because I got clogged up with uh, debris that I couldn't see and it was rocks and plastic chips uh, that were inside of the spawn that clogged up my impeller and potentially could have uh, broken it and this is what we found in here uh, this plastic piece that we couldn't see and all these little bit of rocks that we threw from the debris in here these are the things you got to be careful with and just scanning everything as best as you possibly can. You're probably not gonna see everything because of the murkiness of the water and the amount of debris that, uh, you know, these rocks and chips and plastic pieces and things of that nature could be lying underneath the debris and in the murkiness of the water. So, I continue. All right, so as we're vacuuming out this, uh, all the dirt and debris inside of the swimming pool, I know that I do not want to uh, completely try to vacuum this whole entire swimming pool all in one uh, one uh, fell swoop because of the fact that the amount of debris is going to fill up the bag I gotta you gotta remember too that you know you gotta continue your day and if you're like most pool uh, technicians you're probably only dealing with one bag at a time and you don't want to have a rip in your bag so I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna vacuum my half of this pool empty out the contents of my bag and then uh, do the other half of the swimming pool just to ensure that I don't overload the bag and possibly pop it with an uh, extreme amount of load inside of it. All right, so we got the whole entire pool completely vacuumed out. You definitely want to do the, your vacuuming when the pool is off to eliminate any uh, water flowing around and pushing the dirt and debris as you're doing your vacuuming and your skimming. So the next thing we're going to go ahead and do is obviously we're going to brush down all the surfaces of the swimming pool. We're going to re-net the top of the pool. We're going to put some uh, little bit of algae killer and some like a little light shock to the swimming pool. Balance out the chemistry, filter the water, make sure that we cleaned out our our skimmer basket or a pump basket and then this will be done so this will do it for how to treat a uh, severely heavy duty uh, uh, a pool that has uh, heavy duty debris inside of it uh, follow these steps number one go ahead and shut down your pool pump uh, to clean out the pool pump basket also to uh, clean out your filter while you're at it and then start by cleaning the top of the surface, skimming everything, and key, key, checking the bottom of the pool and skimming for any debris like rocks, trees, twigs, uh, big branches, and any kind of the big debris that may have been flown into the swimming pool. Um, make sure plastics and all the, all, anything that has major debris that could possibly get your, your vacuum cleaner stuck or a broken impeller or a clogged impeller, then obviously you're gonna go ahead and you're gonna vacuum out your swimming pool. Uh, do not try to do it in four. This is all one pass. This took me four passes. I emptied out my bag four times to eliminate the bag from, uh, from overloading itself because the dirt will clog up the pores of the actual bag. Um, so uh, always keep an extra bag on hand because you never know if you are gonna pick something up that's actually gonna rip your bag and then you're out. So always have an extra bag in hand. Um, then go ahead and brush down your surfaces. Clean up the top of the water a little bit more, skimming it with a uh, finer leaf rake, and then check your chemistry, shock this swimming pool, and allow it to filter for 24 hours continuously. Thank you so much for watching this video. Hopefully, you have learned a little bit about uh, how to clean up this debris filled pool, and we'll be right back with our thoughts. And check that out. 
It's only like 10 minutes of circulation and enough chlorine in the swimming pool. And good filtration, clean filter. This pool's already turning over. Getting ready for the weekend. Yeah, I know the vibes. Fuck your kill this beat, bitch. Whoop, bitch. Bitch, I'm outside of some movie. 